Hi there, my name is Brian Maravich, and I'm going to show you how to create a Facebook tab here that stands out, grabs attention, and when somebody clicks on it, it'll click through to the landing page of your choice, not something that is uh, framed inside of Facebook. Um, this works really well if you're getting traffic to your fan page, which hopefully you are. That's the goal. In this case, this is a fan page. It's new. Actually, it's old. I just haven't been uh, marketing it at all. I set it up and kind of got sidetracked, but it's a good example page. Um, so what you want to do is get uh, first your image, and then I'll show you how to uh, link it through to your landing page. So what you want to do, in my case, I like to get an image with a dark background. Um, you can go to your images that are um, along the theme of whatever your Facebook fan page is, or you can just get a uh, dark background image. So what I'm going to do is um, get that image. I'm going to open it with Snagit. And the size of the image is going to uh, have to be 111 pixels by 74. So uh, I already did that in Snagit. I also like to use uh, Photoshop Elements to uh, make it really pop, but Snagit's really easy for this demonstration. And it works just fine. So here's my dark background. I'm going to um, put some text in here. In this case, it's going to be, you could say something like free videos. I'm going to make that text a little bit bigger. Bear with me here. Uh, let's go with 24. Does that fit? Free videos. Let's see. Not quite. So make the text a little bit smaller. 22. Still working here. Okay, about 20. I'm going to make it as big as you can so that... Uh, okay, so as you can see, black lettering. I want white. I like to use white lettering in a lot of cases with a dark background because it really stands out, so I'm going to do that. Okay, that stands out. You can also um, you know, outline the, the lettering with another color to make it really pop. I'm not going to do that right now. Okay, so let's uh, save this image. I'm just going to uh, file, save as standard format to my desktop. I'm just going to call it face one for now, face one. Okay, and there we have it. Now, uh, the next thing you want to do is uh, you want to install an app, and what you want to do is go to the following link. Let me uh, get that up for you. Hold on one second. Okay, you want to go to this link here when you're logged in. So log into your Facebook account and then go to this link, okay? I'm going to go there now. So I'm going to continue as myself, and let's see, can you see all this? I don't think so. Here we go. So you add a custom page tab to your Facebook page, install page tab. Click that. Choose the Facebook page, so I'm going to choose the MMA training page, and then click add page tab. Okay, so now it's added to my MMA page, and I'm going to go to that page now. Okay, so once I added that app to my fan page, uh, you're going to be directed to this little area, and what you want to do is uh, click one of these choices. In this case, uh, I'm going to redirect, and then I'm going to choose a page of my choice. So in this example, the tab says free videos, and I use that as an example. I don't have a videos page up on the website related to this fan page, because like I said, it's new and it's just an example. So I'm just going to put the uh, URL here. You can put any URL you want. The idea, though, is to get them to click through to a page where you're going to uh, generate a lead or uh, get some revenue from it. So it's going to be a quality landing page, of course, right? And you know all that stuff. If you don't, you know, check back in with uh, my videos and you'll learn more about how to do that. So uh, anyway, you want to click redirect, put the URL in there. Uh, I just don't bother with these settings. Um, I just leave them all off. 
Um, the tab name, though, is I'm going to just say free MMA videos. And then I'm going to click Save Settings. And we're off. And now we can go back to the page, the fan page. And then we will see that the uh, free MMA videos tab is up. This is a, a generic tab that Facebook puts up. So let's replace that with the image we created uh, at the beginning. So what you want to do is click, uh, click that arrow button, uh, click this edit icon, edit settings. See, I've already got the custom tab name in there. Custom tab image, click that. Click change, browse. I'm going to go to my desktop, find it. Where is it? Free videos. Okay, there it is there. And now I'm going to go back to Okay, so now we see it up. Looks, it stands out pretty well, except now what I want to do is I want to move it closer to the middle. So I'm going to go click that arrow button again, click the edit, and uh, swap positions with likes. Okay, okay, now we're done. That's as simple as it can be. And now you have, if you have a Facebook fan page that's getting traffic, whenever they see this tab that stands out and they click on it, they'll be directed to whatever page of your choice. I'll just give you an example and click it. Now we're going to click through. It's going to ask you to, uh, because I'm, already, I'm logged in as the page admin, it's going to have a little pop-up window. So I'll click OK. And then we are going to go to the home page. See? Voila! I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, please subscribe if you like what you learned here, because I've got a lot more good stuff, even better than this coming. Thank you.